this is video recap of trading week august 30 september 3rd so five stocks were on watch list and uh, four stocks gave entry point tesla gave two entries and if uh, each trade were executed with 20k per position potential profit could be two thousand dollars per week so let's start with tesla that's a daily chart tesla made a consolidation near the important level and uh, breakout i consider it as a long signal on monday there was a breakout indeed from first minutes and uh, there was stop by order that triggered when price jumped above 715.22 and long position was closed at this red candle then on this pullback and this indecision red candle again near the support another long position was opened and at this local top in this consolidation second long position on monday was closed so two trades per tesla two profits six dollars and ten dollars take profits respectively next stock coupang ticker cpng this stock was on a short list and you see that uh, a whole week was a choppiness but i traded a momentum on monday after consolidation as close at the historical support as possible so this is monday there was a comeback to the support after several days of pullback and that was my local intraday levels 30.08 and 29.94 i said that there are three scenarios and third scenario played out that's a breakout of the uh, local intraday support level from the first seconds and uh, short position was entered on a stop sell order and short position was closed at this consolidation you see on the rsi indicator there was oversold territory huge movement one agr so several signals that uh, short position must be close and take profit was 83 cents per this trade next stock poshmark ticker posh on a daily there was a consolidation near the important level let's open one hour chart you see there was a beautiful consolidation at 28.76 i consider it breakout above this consolidation as a long signal and uh, on monday also like tesla and coupang there was a breakout half of monday uh, you see uh, consolidation was again but after it breakout was indeed so after huge consolidation there is no need to wait for closing for a consolidation above the resistance i like to open positions immediately and i took long position on this breakout green candle and i closed my position after price made quick move to the upside on this third green candle in a row so on this long trade take profit was 50 cents per share stitch fix this stock was on a short list i said that uh, price under important resistance 42.89 and stitch fix is ready to flush to 30 dollars per share so let's open five minute chart on monday price traded far away from the level but on tuesday price made a spike to the upside this stock was in a short zone that's why any approaching to the resistance i consider as an opportunity to open a short position in this case my thesis was correct after opening on this green candle my short position price flush to the downside more than one dollar and short position was closed with a take profit one dollar forty cents per share 
After that, price returning to the level again on next day, September 1st. That was the most perfect entry point moment for a put options trade, for a short trade, for a swing short trade. That's, you see that after this false breakout, price flushed next whole day. $3 to the downside. And price established a consolidation on Friday. That's a good signal because short sellers have another opportunity to open their positions from the level 40.48. Another entry point after a breakout 39.19. Stitch Fix made a beautiful technical price action this week. Sweet. And the last ticker PATH. I said that uh, there must be a breakout of 64.84, but price made a gap on Monday and a sell-off. So my thesis was wrong, but luckily there was no entry point. That's why I didn't trade and I didn't take any loss. You see, this is gap up, flush, then choppiness. That's a bad, bad signal. You do not want to see choppiness when you want to trade a clear breakout in any side. Choppiness is your enemy. After this choppiness there was a flush to the downside, couple of dollars, then price reached support, made choppiness of that support and then returned above it on Friday on a huge momentum to the upside. So what I can tell about this picture, someone accumulating position. Because false breakout of resistance, false breakout of support, price is uh, held inside the range. That means someone wants to accumulate more share and after that price will go to the upside or to the downside. I think that momentum to the upside more probable, but as usual, I want to see a price action confirmation of my thesis. That's it for this week. In my next video, I will make stock chart analysis to trade for upcoming week.